We gotta understand that no matter what, right? Before we even start into this, we are all God. It doesn't matter what skin color you are. Understand we are not God as well. You gotta contradict everything, question everything. When it comes to race wars, understand that these hackers, they invaded us to hate the skin color that we are in. And on top of that, if you are a carbonated being, the system is going to be against us for an exact reason because of who you are. Our trauma, our pain, our misery, our history, our gifts and our talent is a billion dollar industry. Understand that. Once you understand that, there are people of different color who will get paid more than you and they will try to deframe who you are. They'll try to dissect you and they'll try to use you for their benefit and their gain. They will they will lift you up. There are many doors you can walk into where people of different races can help you. But understand, no matter who you are, you are still just a nigga. In a coop, in a Bentley coop, in a penthouse, a mansion, don't matter. So understand, all these things is meant to be against us, but that's a victim mentality. No matter what you do, keep going hard and keep doing you and your purpose. And when it came to these race wars, we gotta understand how this shit even came about because for one, the people who did enslave our ancestors and enslave us to this day, they are programmed. They are a place, they are literally shapeshifters within an agenda. And the thing is, they don't even know who they are. They are so programmed by subconscious entities that they can't even see they don't know that no matter what they still love us even though they hate us because what's the opposite of hate love understand we were created from the soil so we were here first till an invader named christopher columbus came and he decided to invade the space that we were in by making it his own once he did that all these dis all this dis ease negative programs these negative frequencies bed bugs roaches abominations all this nasty unnatural eating all these distractions all these barbaric sports they came from a different source and a different entity so when they brought this here now look at us now we hate each other. We don't like each other. But the thing is, though, not everybody's like that. You got to understand, for it's all my brothers out there, no matter what it is, understand, I always love you. And you should always love yourself and love the brother that doesn't love you. And love the brother that does love you. Love a sister that loves you. Understand, to all, to all you white people, to all the Asians, Jews, doesn't matter. We are not your enemy, but we can be your enemy. Understand, you are not better than us and we are not better than you. But don't forget, when it comes to history and our origin, stop trying to disrespect who we are. Stop disrespecting yourself. No matter what it is, we have to love each other and always remember, your skin color, your vessel doesn't fucking matter when you die in the simulation. When you resurrect yourself spiritually, you know what I'm saying? You're going to go into the highest heavens. So skin color don't even exist. It's a physical illusion. Because when you die and elevate spirits, your vessel stays here in this realm, in this dimension. You feel what I'm saying? So it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We need to stop fighting against each other and understand what we are doing. Once we elevate together, we can stop anything in this world. And we can have our own government. We can have our own utopia. We can have our own fruition. We had to stop fighting. We had to stop battling each other and stop spreading negativity start spreading hate against one another and understand that if we all could rise when we awaken our consciousness and our third eye nobody could touch us i love you have a great day